Well, caught on a cell phone camera in class, a teacher holding a student by his neck. Now, that teacher was reportedly trying to keep two students apart after an argument started. CBS 2's Dave Lopez talked to the student, joins us live now from Limwood High School. Dave? Well, Jeff, we can tell you we're here in front of the school. The school has suspended that teacher, and also the attorney representing the young student has taken the videotape you're about to see to the L.A. County Sheriff's Department, and they are now conducting an investigation to see if any criminal charges will be filed. The young man in question is a good student, an honor student, plays on the football team, and his mother last year was voted by the PTA of Linwood High School as the Volunteer of the Year. It's 9 o'clock, history class, Linwood High School, and the cell phone video shows 15-year-old Andrew Boyd being put in a chokehold, as he described it, by 53-year-old teacher David Williams. There was no fight. No, there was no fight, never. Did the teacher say anything to you? No, the teacher didn't say anything to me at all. I mean, he just grabbed you? He just grabbed me because I was the closest person to his desk. According to Boyd, he has been having trouble with another male student in that classroom. Verbal altercations quite often. And that's what happened on that day. The other student was yelling at Boyd. Boyd said he got up, and that's when the teacher grabbed him. He grabbed me hard. Do you have trouble breathing? Not anymore, but uh, when he had me in the chokehold, yeah. Did you come close to wanting to hit him? No, I didn't. I didn't, because I, I know what type of person I am, so I, I wouldn't. Like I was raised, the way I was brought up, I was like not to put my hands on the teacher or anything but like he's that. I'm, I'm worried about his safety. Mm -hmm. And if he'll be able to focus and be able to be successful. His mother, Willetti Jones, still gets emotional about all this. A deeply religious woman, she went to a prayer group and asked for guidance through prayer what to do. Someone in the group said, you need a lawyer. Well, the first thing we have to do is we have to figure out how we can get um, multiple school districts to cooperate with each other. Because if Linwood High School is not the best environment for um, not just Andrew, but his younger brother, Adrian, who's um, right behind him, we have to get Linwood to release them, and then we have to get another high school to take them. According to Ms. Dobson, the teacher told his principal he never touched the student. Then came the video. No on-camera comment from Linwood, the Linwood uh, Unified School District, but this statement in part, quote, the Linwood Unified School District does not condone physical violence in any form and takes this matter very seriously. We are fully committed to ensuring all of our schools are safe and secure learning environments for our students, families, and staff. Again, the teacher, Mr. Williams, 53, a veteran in this school, has been placed on administrative leave, and the uh, L.A. County Sheriff's Department is looking at possible, and I underline the word possible, criminal charges. Reporting live from Linwood, I'm Dave Lopez, CBS 2 News.